Hey everybody, so earlier today, Sony announced a brand new model of PlayStation 3, the PlayStation 3 Slim. And I'm standing here with hardware editor Sarju Shah, and we're going to check it out for you. Sarju, take it away. This thing is looking pretty sweet. So, popped out in Germany for a price of $299, down from $399, which is always welcome. Shall we just crack open the box here? We shall, and while you're doing that, I'm going to check out the press release. So, it is going to be available in stores on September 1st uh, in the North American, Europe, and PAL territories. and. Asian countries and regions at a very attractive, well, their press release at a very attractive uh, recommended retail price of 299 and 299 pounds, respectively. In Japan, you can check it out uh, at uh, on September 3rd for 29,980 yen. And the really cool thing for folks that can't wait is that starting tomorrow, all models of PlayStation 3 are going to be sliced down to 299 as well. So, all right, let's look at this thing, which Piece is... Piece de la resistance. It's tiny. Yes. Oh, there we are. And anybody that saw the leaked pictures, well, I guess they were right. Boom. All right, let's, uh, let's get this... Let's get these guys side by side. It is considerably smaller. Yeah. Like half the height? So, according to the release, which I will look at again, they are saying it is two-thirds smaller. By volume? Probably. In terms of uh, length, we got... That's yeah, a little less wide by an inch, right? Something like that. About half as tall. Just as heavy. <laughs> <laughs> and you've got all the ports uh, that you would in the back on both and in front. As usual, you got no memory cards, but no memory card slots like you had before, but you do have two USB ports. We also switched up the buttons to actual buttons as opposed to the uh, touch-sensitive ones that were on there before. Very cool. Let's see. Now, the stuff that you guys aren't seeing is that, uh, let's see, there's going to be a new system update for the cross-media bar on the PlayStation 3 to take advantage of the Slim. Uh, which will now include a Bravia Sync feature that will allow televisions, obviously Sony televisions, equipped with the Bravia Sync feature uh, to allow the system to be controlled by the Bravia's remote control. Which is actually one step up because before you'd actually have to buy, like if, if you actually had a Harmony remote, you'd have to buy a Harmony adapter. Yep. So that takes out an extra 50 bucks. <laughs> or the big PS3 thing, yeah. um, which that really long remote. On top of that, there's a new vertical stand because obviously you can't fit this in the old one. Now, one interesting little omission from this model is that the install other OS feature is gone. Mm -hmm. So this means that people will not be installing Linux on their PS3 and doing all kinds of interesting things like they do. <laughs> now, Sarge, do you see any place where anyone would get hard drive access? That was on this side before, and uh, no. that's hiding. Interesting. Okay. Actually, there's no obvious point of entry. Um, that bay door right there. This little guy here is pretty tiny. Uh, indeed, that is it. Very nice. It rotates out. Sure there's a little uh, screwdriver over there. Yeah. Pop it out just like the old one. And I'm guessing this thing just slides up. And uh, pop it on your drive if you need. We're already up to a 120 in here, and uh, you know, you can basically dra drag in a, uh, or we have a, a regular laptop drive for maybe like another 100 bucks. You're up to like 500 gig. Everyone's happy. Very cool. And then what folks didn't see is that inside the box you get your standard USB cable and controller. Mm. Black. And, uh, what kind of cables do we got here? What have we got? Do you? There we go. Here we are. The usual uh, ooh, AV cables, power cable, and uh, USB cable. Nothing too surprising. Fairly standard. So there you go. That's your first look at the PlayStation 3 Slim. Sarge, any final thoughts? It's cheaper and it's smaller. What's not to like? Pretty much. So we're going to be putting this thing through its paces. Be sure and check back on the site for a feature and for a bunch of video. Until then, we'll see you soon.